Hello and welcome back friends. Today we have another Conway flashlight. It's M21F with SFT40. It's a pocket thrower. And as always I made some photos, how it looks. And please don't skip photos because at the end there will be a photo showing the color temperature of the LED and the tint. Also, as always, I will put links to video description where you can find it. Hello friends! First I want to apologize for not making videos for quite some time. I had COVID, now I'm fine. And today we have Convoy M21F pocket thrower. To compare size, here is S11 from Convoy. And the size is almost the same on those. Also I chose L21A with SSD40 to compare throw of those two flashlights. You'll see it later in item shots. And now let's see the design. So a silver bezel, smooth reflector and SFT40 inside. You have deep fins, side button. On the opposite side you have USB-C charging port which is a bit hard to open but it's good because when you use the flashlight it does not accidentally open as in previous Conway flashlights. Also quite new knurling to Conway and ribs on tail cap. Also you have four holes for attaching lanyard just don't forget to put it like this so you can tail stand your flashlight. This lanyard came with the flashlight. Now the button. It's clicky, but the travel is short and it's a bit hard to press. And at least for me, this is the only downside of this flashlight. Inside we have 21700 battery. In all my tests I used Samsung 40T and as always you can open from two sides from the head and the tail cap. Both sides has o-rings. Head part is not anodized. Here inside the head you have cylinder contact. and on the tail cap the spring. Threads are very smooth. Easy to open, easy to close. The battery inside does not shake. Stays firm. And that's it about the look. Usage is like previous Convoy flashlights with this design where you have the button and the charging port. So you can watch my 4X18A video. It will be here. And there I talked how to use the flashlight and all the modes. One click to turn on. One click to turn off. Hold to switch modes, double press turbo and everything else explained in my previous review. So that's it about the look of the flashlight. Now let's move to the nighttime shots and later runtime graphs.
Hope you enjoyed those Titan shots. Now let's take a look at random graphs. And here we see that all modes has stabilization, except turbo. I will post link in video description where you can find those graphs. And I also made a graph showing you how you can access turbo more than once if you cool the flashlight. My final thoughts about this flashlight. In my opinion, it's very successful model from Convoy. And the only downside is the button. I like the button in 4X18A better than this one. Overall, design is very nice. I like the silver bezel, deep fins, and the size of this flashlight, knowing that it throws almost the same as L21A. And you can put this flashlight in the pocket. Also, I like that it uses 21700 battery and this extends the time of the use. Also a big advantage of this flashlight as in most convoys is stabilization of the brightness and what it means I got questions in comments. Stabilization is that after your battery depletes your flashlight keeps shining the same output as it was before when the battery was full. So I think for the money you pay for this flashlight it's perfect and that's about it and thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and help me grow and see you in the next video. Goodbye.